Hey, what's up, guys? So let's solve this six 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 uh, six six one image smooth. Also, uh, so you have a uh, you have a uh, three by three filter, and uh, so for each field, uh, for each number, let's say the center is seven, it will smooth uh, smooth this part, and for this twenty five, you only use the these four to smooth. Okay, so you need to do the average. For example, uh, maybe it's hard to understand, right? Okay, so for example, for this one, uh, for this one, you get sum of three, so divided by four is zero. But for this one, uh, you get one, two, three, four, five, six, right? The total is five, five divided by six is zero. For this one, uh, so all, all, all are zeros. Okay, so for this one, 100, you need to take the, take this four. You, you, you should imagine that there is a three by three block center at 100. Uh, maybe 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 let me just 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 draw something. Okay, so you can start here, right? So you 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 you, you imagine this, right? So you get these four summation is a uh, sum of four of them is a uh, this and divided by four is one hundred thirty seven point five. So put here, and for this one uh, average is six of them. Okay, and I just do one by one. Also, this problem is very uh. Very, uh, I would say, uh, cumbersome, right? Because, uh, for each center, you need to ask how many of them you need to do average. For example, for fifty, you you can do nine, right? But for this one, you can do six. For this one, you can do four. Also, uh, one idea is that you just brute force, right? Define m to be length n, and then you create your answer. And for each center, right? For i in range m, for j in range n, this is the center, right? So let's say you initialize the n, and you initialize count. So counts you uh, is a dummy variable that uh, check how many uh, indices that you need to do average. And if you run from your J1 in range minus one, two, because you need to do minus one, zero and one, right? So for example, you start from here, you need to do left or right or up or down. Okay, so your maximum uh, is nine, right? So uh, for this small I1 and J1, and uh, you you need to check that for i greater i plus i one greater than zero and i plus i one less than minus one, so this is boundary. So once you satisfy the boundary, that means you find the answer. You find the number that which you can add. Right? So your count should add one, and your answer should add this. Also for each center, for each centers, you get your sum divided by your uh, how many? Okay, then so you return s. Well, so brute force, right? But uh, I think this problem is very very boring. So I mean just. Run a very simple code solving. See you guys next video.